What is up YouTube and welcome to another one of my not so often uploaded videos and uh, today I am super excited because it is getting warmer and summer is coming closer and uh, we're finally gonna be doing some videos with the i8 again uh, but today we're gonna do three things I had some people ask me dude you're 6'5 250 pounds how do you even get in and out of this thing so i'm gonna show you guys a quick quick uh, quick video later on on how i manage that and what the trick is to getting in and out uh the second thing is i know gas prices are crazy expensive right now and uh, everybody thinks it's a sports car and it thinks it takes a bunch of gas and you'll be surprised because it's a hybrid on how much uh small the gas tank is and what the cost to uh, run one of these even though you get 400 miles of range once you uh, once you fill it up all the way and then the last thing we're gonna do is not my favorite part but uh, we're gonna have to do the annual maintenance again so with car show starting and everything um, we're gonna we're gonna have to start we're gonna have to do the annual maintenance today and so we're going down to the BMW uh, dealership at Kansas City do that it shouldn't hopefully be too crazy but um, you know unless something pops up then uh, we'll have to just deal with it when we get there but uh, first thing is let's start her up this is probably gonna be the coldest 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 cold start ever because I, I don't think I've turned her on <laughs> uh, in in a few months so let's let's start her up hopefully she cranks up and then we'll uh, we'll go to the gas station get some gas and then we'll head out to uh, BMW to get the maintenance and then they'll uh, wrap up the video, so let's go. So, put them in the comments below. But uh, let's let's fast forward a little bit. All right, did you guess it right? Because this is the total to fill up the whole gas tank. So, ten gallon gas tank, forty bucks to fill it up. And like I said, the range on this car is uh, four hundred miles once you. Uh, fill it up so yeah I know it's not a V8 or a V10 but you can go a whole lot distance for, uh, for 40 bucks in this car so all right let's uh, hop in and then we're gonna do the video on how I get in and out All right, here it is uh, one more time in real, real time. So you just have to walk up to the car, plant yourself like this, bend down, and literally just fall in. Ow, minus the head bump. But that is all. And then you are in the car. So plenty of space, headroom, leg room I'm not even bumping into the steering wheel or the mid console here so yeah it looks like a small car but 6'5 250 pounds easily could fit into it so there you go all right so we're here at the BMW 
Taylor ship. So we're gonna go and drop off the uh, I-8 and unfortunately have to go back to the office and uh, but when they call us and say the car's ready then we'll uh, see what the damage is so but I'll, uh, I'll, I'll uh, continue the video as soon as I uh, get the car back so see if they got any cool cars here see a Z06 over there and the BMW the other trip that's kind of cool so all right, so let's go and uh, turn this baby in and uh, we'll, we'll go over the uh, invoice slip. So we're back and I know everybody's anxious to know what the numbers are for the 30,000 mile maintenance. So here are the numbers. Um, there's four things to do that they recommend to do at 30,000 uh, 30, miles. I only did the oil change because my car only has 18,000 miles on it. But the three, four things to do is, and their cost are oil change. That one was $180. Uh, cabin filter that was $227.31. Replace spark plugs, there's three of them because it's a three cylinder engine, uh, $279.93. And then also it's uh, these door hinges here. I guess they need to check them and retorque them just to make sure they're doing their job and keeping the door up, uh, $56.41. Uh, so if you add them up, I don't have the math in my head, but roughly uh, about 800 uh, bucks or 600 bucks or 700 bucks, uh, but I'll have the number here. So I believe it's about 700 bucks or so, but that is the cost to do all four things. Uh, so not too bad for 30,000 mile maintenance. I mean, it's less than a grand, which is, um, you know, less than an old change on, you know, let's say a Huracan or something. I mean, they, I think they charge like a thousand bucks just to uh, the oil change uh, on, the, on those. So, hope you liked the video. If you have any questions, please let me know in the comments. If you want to see something else, let me know in the comments. Uh, subscribe, like, stay tuned for more videos. But uh, there'll be two upcoming videos here shortly. One is going to be, there's a car show that I'm taking the IA to at the, uh, this weekend and hopefully we'll maybe win something and then uh, at the end of the month there's also a car show uh, that we'll go attend and see what kind of cars they have out there and check it out so again thanks for watching the video and you guys have a great day peace